little cranky today, bro. Because I don't like the shit I'm seeing up here. These videos, a lot of these channels is getting under my skin. For real. But I want to say this, right? Errol Spence and Ugas Saturday night. Ugas is a great fighter. Excellent fighter. Absolutely. But let's be honest here, bro. Everybody expect Errol Spence to watch this dude. He, not, he don't really have the power to, make, to keep Errol off of him. At least that's what it's looking like. He probably have respectable power. like I mean, like most boxers. But the truth of the matter is, most people expect Errol Spence to go in there and beat this dude. Not saying it's going to be easy. Many people are going in there uh, are expecting this to be easy for uh, 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 a win for Errol. But let me ask you Errol fans this, though. The sexuals, really. What if Errol Spence... What if... A couple of questions. What if it's a close fight with Ugas? What if Ugas do his thing? What if it's like really razor thin and Errol pulls it off? What you got to say about Errol? Does that mean, um, you know, uh, Errol needs some work? Or does that mean Ugas is just that good of a fighter? Or does that mean... That Errol ain't what you say he is. Also, let's just say Errol Spence whoops Ugas convincingly, smashes him. All right, what y'all, what y'all want a cookie? They ain't supposed to do that. I mean, according to y'all, right? <laughs> He's supposed to do that, right? So if Errol smashes him Saturday night, I already know y'all gonna be like, I told you, I told you, my boy Errol, I told you, man down his back, baby. Uh, not so fast. There's still one guy left. And his name is Terrence Bud Crawford. Ooh, guys, is not. He is no Bud Crawford. When he beats the final level and smashes Bud, then you can raise your hands for joy. Other than that, sit your motherfucking asses down. Now I'm off this.